We are going to be taking the Detroit Lions roster down to 53 players, and in this video we are going to be focusing on the secondary. So this thought actually came to me at like 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm not even kidding, that's when this came to me, but I think this is a super good idea. So I wrote it down, I was super tired, trying to find a light, I was like, okay, write this idea down, and I'm here, and now we're going to do it. So basically what we're going to be doing is getting the Detroit Lions roster down to that 53-man roster, that roster that they have to have before the season starts. With that being said, it's kind of a prediction, but also what I would do if I was a Detroit Lions GM. Make sure you guys let me know in the comments below what moves you would have made that I didn't make, or different, guy, different guys that you would have kept instead of cut. Really going to be taking a look at back at last season in 2018, the Detroit Lions roster. Because in 2018, the Detroit Lions held 10 secondary players. And that's how we're kind of going to base this because it's the same scheme, Matt Patricia and everybody like that. So with that being said, last year again, Detroit Lions held 10 secondary players, six cornerbacks, for safety. So with that being said, that's what we're going to do in this video. And we're going to get it started naming the 10 players on the secondary that will be with the squad. And anybody that I don't name will be released, whether they're going to cut or traded, whatever it may be. They're not going to make the team. So let's get right into it. We're going to start off with the cornerback position. And going through the cornerbacks, the first guy that makes the team is Darius Big Play Slay. I can't keep Darius Slay off the team. Now, if he leaves or whatever crazy stuff goes on, that's on him. But either way, he's staying with the squad. I'm not letting this man go. Next up on the cornerback position, that was an easy one. We have Rashawn Melvin. Okay, Rashawn Melvin, you made the cut. Moving all around the league, played with the Patriots, played with the Raiders. He's a veteran type of cornerback who's been solid throughout his career. We're expecting a solid presence from Rashawn Melvin. He could be that number two cornerback for us in 2019. And he's really a reliable cornerback that we have now. So Rashawn Melvin, you make the squad. Now let's jump over to the safety position, okay? I don't want to go too far in order. So we're going to jump over to the safety position real quick. And the first safety that has made the team is Quandre Diggs. Quandre Diggs, one of the most underrated players on the Detroit Lions, one of their best players. Six interceptions in the last two seasons. Been absolutely outstanding. Our best safety right now currently on the roster. Quantre Diggs, you are on the squad. That makes three players that have now made the team. Now, moving back to the cornerback position. Next up, Justin Coleman. You have made the team as our slot cornerback for 2019. We gave you $36 million for four years. And to be our slot cornerback, you're one of the best ranked by Pro Football Focus. So with that being said, you have to make the team, my man. Hopefully you can help us out, play that cornerback position very well. And now we have four players currently on the roster. Jump back to the safety position. Our next safety that has made the team is... Tracy Walker. Tracy Walker, you made the team. Now, you're probably going to be our number two safety going into 2019. We're hoping for a big jump for you, Tracy. With Quandre Diggs deciding to retire a couple of days ago, Tracy Walker, you're going to have to take over as that number two safety. Hopefully, you can have a breakout season in 2019. You're definitely poised to do it. We're looking for a lot from you, Tracy Walker, but we have good hopes that you can definitely get it done. Tracy Walker has made the team. That moves us to five players, and we have five remaining spots in the secondary. Who will it be? Let's get right into it. Going back to the cornerback position, we have Jalen Tease Tabor. Yes, Jalen Tease Tabor, you have made the team. You are a cornerback that we are hoping to take the next step in 2019 from really rock bottom. Hopefully, you can jump up to what that potential we saw during the offseason, and you can become a really good player for the Detroit Lions. Heck, if you play well enough, you could be the number two cornerback. So hopefully, that's a possibility. A former second-round pick out of Florida. We have high hopes for your Tease Tabor, and that moves us to six players. Now, let's hop back to the safety position where we have the rookie safety. Traded up for in the third round, Will Harris out of Boston College. Okay, we've done a breakdown on Will Harris. Very big hitter, really good leader. He's huge for this Detroit Lions defense, especially with the absence of Glover Quinn. He is the seventh player that has made the roster for the Detroit Lions secondary. We're going to hop back to that cornerback position. And next up is Amani Orowari. I think I said that right. That was pretty good, actually. But Amani, you were on the team, and that is the eighth player to make the secondary. Amani, you are a rookie, a fifth round pick out of Penn State. High hopes for you, Amani. In the future, you could have a very, very big role with the Detroit Lions. Who knows, that could be in 2019, depending on things that happen, because you just really never know. This is a really good player. We can't let go of any rookies, and he is the eighth player. So that leaves two spots remaining. Who are those guys gonna be? Will it be Michael Ford? Will it be Charles Washington? Will it be Dee Virgin? Who will make the final two spots? Let's hop into it. Hopping back to the safety position, the final safety to make the cut. Andrew Adams, the man we signed this offseason out of free agency. Andrew Adams looking like a depth type of safety. Has been very good recently. Andrew Adams, we're bringing you into the squad, man. You're the final safety. You're the final depth safety. You can do multiple things. You can play in 
special teams. And with that being said, that means that two former safeties, Tavon Wilson and Miles Kildabrew, will be on their way out. And Andrew Adams, they, we're going to get a new face in there. We're going to try something new. And that is the ninth player out of the 10 for the secondary. And now moving on to that final position. Who will it be? So we know it's not going to be a safety. It's going to be one last cornerback. So there's a couple options out there. We have Michael Ford. We have Jamal Agnew. We have D. Virgin. Who will be that final man to make the roster cut? Drum roll, please. I'll do the drum roll. We have Jamal Agnew. The final roster spots for the secondary goes to Jamal Agnew. We couldn't keep this man off the list. He's our punt returner for 2019. He potentially could be our kick returner as well. He's an all-pro at it when he's healthy. He's a good depth cornerback. We have to keep him around. And those are the 10 players that make the final cut for the secondary. That means guys like Tavon Wilson, Miles Kildabrew, and Michael Ford will all be off the squad for 2019, whether they're cut or traded. But those are the 10 guys that we have. In the next video, we will focus on a different position group until we are finally down to that 53-man roster. If you guys like this, make sure you leave support on this video by leaving a like and also letting me know down in the comments below. Thank you, Brad, for watching, and I'm out.